guys, V here. Today is a very special day because we are testing out the magical hairbrush. Lots of people have been talking about this and I wanted to see if it actually works. If you haven't heard about this yet, it is a magical hairbrush that you actually plug into the wall and it strings your hair. So, yeah. I filmed myself trying it a few days ago and I want to show you guys what happened. I feel like I look like that one girl from Brave. This is my natural hair. I didn't do anything to it. I didn't even brush it yet. Just let it air dry. And I have a lot of hair. So I really hope this does work because it kind of takes me a long time to straighten it. And that would be great if this cut down the time. Aww. Off to a good start. This is a really thick cord. The good thing about this specific one that I got, she has a converter to uh, the US. This is so weird, look at that. <laughs> Never seen one of these before. <laughs> I don't know if you guys can see that. But right there. I think that's just an extra one to get it out. So we have that. I like how it actually shows it climbing up to the heat. So this is in Celsius, but I heard a rumor if you press both buttons at the same time. Oh! It turns into Fahrenheit. So obviously the scare, um, in doing this is that you're gonna burn your scalp when you because that's what I was thinking I was thinking like how are you gonna do that if it's gonna burn your scalp off but actually looking at it um, but it's not like it's warm but it's not hot the red things the bubbles the red bubbles it would be pretty hard to burn yourself on this just because there's, there's so much bristles and stuff in this little guard thing and so it's pretty, it looks pretty safe to me. Let's see this action right here. Oh, darn it. I forgot to brush my hair. That would help to follow directions, huh? See the steam coming off of it. I don't know if you can see that. Is it supposed to do that? So after a few passes, um, it, it's straighter, it's giving off a weird smell, like fish. <laughs> I think that's probably because it's new, and usually like new irons and things like that, they always have like a coating on it, which when it burns off, it smells kind of gross, that's probably what's going on right there. Ooh, magical hairbrush! Here's a before shot. Pretty curly. Four strokes. And I'd say it's a lot smoother and a lot straighter. Oh. Oh, there we go. Oh, I kind of curled the ends. It's so genius. Ta-da. This is smoking a lot. So what kind of sucks about this handle here is that there are buttons right on the handle. So when I'm trying to maneuver with it, I accidentally press the buttons, and that happens kind of a lot. So the temperature kind of switches up because I do that, which is not a super big deal, but kind of inconvenient. Whoa! I'm going to try my bangs here. Oh, it's actually nice. I'm going to try it with this hair that's close to my face because that's something I wanted to find out, if it actually straightens hair close to your face. So let's see. Lots of steam. Oh, it's hot. Whew. It's getting pretty hot in here. Did a pretty decent job, actually. Like, not too bad. If I do say so myself. So, guys, this is the final product. <laughs>it claims that it strains hair five to ten times faster I don't know if I would go that far but it definitely does cut off some time and since it does straighten your hair faster you don't have to apply that much heat going over and over your hair so I'd say it damages your hair less than if you just normally would straighten it with a straightener I think it's also better if you're trying to straighten the back of your hair because I know all you girls have those troubles when you straighten your hair and you think it's perfect but then you can't see the back and it's actually there's like these random curly pieces 
I know the struggle. I'd also say it's safer than a normal straightener because in a normal straightener the sides of the straightener are just exposed and you can burn yourself. But with this there's little bristles and everything guarding it so it's safer too. You can give it to the youngins. So now it's time to learn a new Russian word. Today's Russian word is... Uh, today's Russian word is Rashoska, which means hairbrush. That's pronounced Rashoska. Rashoska. So don't forget to subscribe, like this video if you enjoyed it, and leave a comment. I'd really appreciate it. And also find me on Snapchat. My Snapchat name is SweetOVB. I recently decided that I want you guys to be part of my Snapchat family, so be sure to add me on there if you haven't already. And also find me on Facebook and Instagram. I'll see you next week. Bye!